Hello, my name is Liz. I'm one of the co-founders for Vegan Cuban Cuisine. Vegan Cuban Cuisine is pretty much a plant-based vegan restaurant. It's located on Sunset Drive in the Miami area. We recently started this business to bring the Miami community the option to have plant-based Cuban food, delicious food without having the animals involved. So before uh, opening Vegan Cuban Cuisine, I was practicing my career, which is in architecture. I studied at the FIU University. I love architecture, but it was something about veganism. So my favorite part of owning this business, having that contact with the customers. For some reason, people that love uh, what we do and they respect what we're doing, they always give great feedback. They let us know that to keep going, to, to keep pushing, because they like the mission. And the mission is to reduce the amount of animals that we're consuming and also to give Miami the opportunity to have a healthier Cuban food. The most costly part of our business, I would say, would be containers and all the biodegradable products that we use. We are a completely plastic-free business. I started playing with vegan cuisine when I became vegan about three or more years ago. It was very interesting to see how it is easy to change um, a, a, a Hispanic recipe just by changing the protein because at the end the seasoning was the same. So I got into cooking uh, when I became vegan. I needed to create alternatives that will be delicious for myself and my family. My family, it was hard to believe that you could make any vegan dish taste good, especially being Cuban, that we tend to have all these animal products, all this animal fat, because you don't need the animal, all you need is the seasoning and the right spices to make it delicious. I guess that for someone to start an operation like us, I think it requires a lot of persistence and uh, always find something that you're passionate about. We're passionate about bringing our community this new option and about all the environmental benefits that it has. Uh, so I think it's very important to use social media for your businesses, especially in our business. We started on, on social media. We started on, on, on Instagram. We started in a time where people were starting to get more educated when it comes to eating plant-based and the benefits. You know, maybe just alternating some of our food, how that could have an impact on the environment. Not sure if I should try it, so we gave that option of we can do it, you know, we're making Cuban food that can taste good and is vegan. Cubans, we, we tend to eat a lot of animals. It's part of our culture, part of our traditions. When we gather, we do that. Uh, so what we did is that we're not, we're not taking away um, the culture. The culture is still alive. The culture is us coming together, us um, having these conversations, enjoying the delicious food. My family, for instance, uh, when, I, when we started with the business, we started to experiment with different recipes and we would tr bring it to our, to our parties, to our hot gatherings, and it was surprising to see that it was hard for them to give, it them, tr to give them a try, because in their mind, it's like there's no way it could taste even good. So it was funny uh, because they didn't want to, but they felt like they should have tried it. So at the end of the party, I remember one of the, of the events that we won, uh, we took imperial rice, we took croquetas, sandwich cubanos, and all the different dishes that we're used to eating. They were trying to avoid it, so they started eating the rest of the stuff that were on the table, but at the end of the party, they were like, felt like, okay, I'm gonna give them a try. And they ended up loving it. They were like surprised. They're like, how are you doing this? You should make a business out of it. Many people on our team are family. Everything they do, they do it with love. They love the mission. Hello guys, I'm Steven and I am one of the co-founders of Vegan Cuban Cuisine. Before I, we started Vegan Cuban Cuisine, I was a social media manager, and that is where the, that idea of Vegan Cuban Cuisine mixed with social media and also uh, the cooking from my mom that started the recipe list that put the website design and all the other stuff. Our family has supported us since day one. The first vegan Cuban dish that I had was when my mom veganized our famous imperial rice. It was on a family gathering mm -hmm. that we went to and she veganized a dish for me and Liz to be able to eat. And the first bite that I had at that with the sweet plantains, baked sweet plantains, it was amazing. It brought back all the memories that I had from eating Cuban food, but without the animal products. Mm -hmm. And it blew my mind. So what's next for Vegan Cuban Cuisine is that um, we want to grow this location to be bigger, to be able to bring people inside. I enjoy your meal in a more friendly atmosphere. And also we want to start 
doing nationwide shipping, being able to ship our croquetas and some of our products to be able to reach California and all those states that are New York, Georgia, Chicago, anywhere in the U.S.